my son come 18 and not been shot dead in the street before I could see that, not be back in prison. You understand? Mm-hmm. Right? So I don't need a day for that. I was thankful yesterday. Yeah. And the, and the day before that. I'm oh. just asking what yeah, I don't like you can't, talking yeah, about I don't, things. You came at me real... Uh, you come out of with these family matters. Yeah. That was holiday real, questions. Yeah, that was real... Uh, Cosby show shit. We don't... Yeah, that was real. Crazy. That was crazy? Yeah, man. You felt I tried to get vulnerable just a yeah, little bit? Yeah, you just tried to go in it. Like, you know, like, I felt like that was a uh, Kathy Lee and Regis. I feel like she locked in on you. Yeah, like, she, she went to it. Because yeah. he always tried to dodge questions, so it's entertaining to I'm, see him try to dodge I'm, it or get I'm offended. I'm not trying by. to dodge it, though. I'm <laughs> thankful every single day. I you know? live a great life. Listen, I'm grateful. My son just turned 18 yesterday. Yeah, it's my baby. All right? He's not is, a baby anymore. Do you know how I felt? His mother, I spoke to his mother. She said, Jermaine, you've been an asshole to me, but you've been good, and I'm thankful, and I'm grateful. I made me feel good. You're a great father. Aggressive. Coming from her, that's, that shit felt good. Say what? I said, you want to hear it again? Yeah, I want to hear what you said. I said you're a great father. I never felt that way. That was crazy, though. He turned 18. I remember I was to pick him up and then take him. He's good. I remember when me and used to play fight. Get little moon pies. Yeah. On a sandwich and pick him up from school. Yeah. I little never dad felt dolls. He's that way. Me and Zane, thing. dad used to play to fight the, all the time. He's taking the Toys R Us. Mm-hmm. Now he's 18. He's talking about drip, Dior. Hair all long. Mm-hmm. Then, oh, That's man. my baby. I love Zane. It, feel, it don't feel like it was yesterday. Yesterday, that's how time is. And, and the funny thing is about Zane was born when I was in prison. I was in my violation. When I came home, he was three months old. And I was like, man, shish, fuck I'm gonna do. I gotta be a father, a husband, I'm on parole, street shit going on. Just trying to figure it out. I wanna be in the rap game. Just mad stuff for me to try to figure out. And it was like, oh, man, that'll work. It was like, and I was having a hard time because I was I was having issues with his mother because I wanted to be in the street. A lot of my experiences was brand new. I didn't know what it felt like to be outside, like you know, in the mix of things. All of it was new, clubbing, like girls. I just was so intoxicated with it. I was so attracted to it that I was clashing with her, and it was like, you know. We was having issues, but my 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 love for my son was was was, was on one thousand. But I was I was translating to maybe it, it was it was a lot, man. It was a lot. So to be able to have gotten through all that and look back at that, and not to mention what I was going through in the street, you know. So sheesh, man. Speaking of that, you know what I'm thinking about? What? And versus it. Oh, shit. That was big. It was big. That was super. I'm fine. Super. You yeah. wanted me to be extra? No, you got like seductive voice on right now. I'm trying to. She like, you like what I'm in? Oh, oh okay. <laughs> if that was a son. That was a legend. That was a. That was a. That is that the highest view versus? I don't know. Mm. Is it? How many? How well, many? We don't, we how don't many views was it? Your information I don't think correct. so. At one point eight. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Nah, Some, that wasn't the highest. Uh, was that? Was one point eight? It was. I don't think that was the highest. It was one point eight. Who had the highest? Uh, um, uh, Billy Man. You know? Right. We not. We not going with what he's saying. They had a lot in there. We not going with what he's saying. We, nah. we, we, gonna, we can, we we can investigate. Out, how many Monica, like Patty LaBelle, and how many they had? No, we, we, we gonna investigate. Nah, they didn't ring off. The highest that I remember Listen, was Gucci Beanie Man. Use this. Use that. Use that. Use that. Use that was that. big. Gucci Man came out very disrespectful and aggressive. I thought it was gonna be. Listen, let me tell you something. There some times when I thought it was gonna be something else, something else happening. Mm-hmm. No, but Gigi kept his class. He never broke. He but never I, broke and kept his class. Yeah, it was a, um, I mean, and you know, you it's them, a lot of... You see them do the uh, so icy at the end? That was big for culture. Let me tell you something, though. I've been watching that, and I've been following what was, what's been going on. And I've been hearing, and I've been watching a lot of, a lot of what people have been saying. And I've caught a conversation um, uh, that my song was having about it. We talked about evolution and being men. 
and black men and how we need to evolve. And I'm all for that. I get that. Um, and I and I'm and I'm and I'm and I'm trying to really be really be honest and really be real about the situation at the same time. I feel like I've evolved as a person. I feel like we all have because there's no way gaining experiences and not evolving, right? But. in situations and environments and people that you may be dealing with or have to deal with are not involved. Right? So sometimes I'm like at a place where I feel like how can I can be so evolved and I deal with an element of, of people that are not. Right? Sometimes as evolved as I could possibly be, sometimes niggas need to know that you step on their hands. I put my hands out, and he got a knife in his hand. Like, some, it's like it has to be a balance. Like, I, I'm all for evolution. That's development. That's us growing up, us maturing. I talked about that, right? But everybody's not on that same page. Everybody's not on that same page. And that could be a detriment to you in a certain environment or certain situation. You understand? So it's sometimes it's like, damn, how do you how do you how do you move? Uh, because how you supposed to move? It's like when you know better, you do better. And also, whoa, 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 let's these statements right there. We gotta we gotta we gotta go. We gotta emphasize what you're okay. saying. So basically, what I'm saying is. I mean, I'm a, I feel like I'm a matured, growing person as well. And I'm also a person who lives in a world where everybody isn't so mature. Some people aren't aware of themselves. They aren't aware that their emotions get the best of them. They aren't aware that their ego gets the best of them, right? And we kind of seen that in the verses. You get what I'm saying? Not everybody is mature enough or aware enough of themselves to deal with certain things because it, it also depends on the environment that you surround yourself in. You could be sitting right next to somebody and having a conversation and you realize that you're not even on the same level just by how their interpretation of life is. Let me ask you this though. I seen somebody uh, speaking about Gucci and Jeezy and say something to the extent of, uh, well, from the perspective of, of Gucci, from his perspective, everybody is saying, oh, he was ignorant, this and that. But let's look at it from his standpoint. His standpoint is, yo, niggas can't even kill me. Absolutely. Right? To that right. So certain things you never, ever forget. What if they succeeded? Right. Now, now not not to say that Jeezy had anything to do with it or whatever. That ain't, that ain't what I'm saying. But that's what... what what the energy is, that's what the perception is. And from that standpoint, sometimes it's like, it's, it's, it's situations that's forever. It's lifetime issues with niggas, with men, like forever, so. And, like, you, like I said, it still has to do with your pride now. And you, right. listen, listen to what I'm saying. I'm big on I'm big on these I'm big on these words and egos and stuff like that. I have an ego. I have pride. I'm a very proper person, but I'm also a very aware person and, and I talk myself through things now. You get what I'm saying? You get into your emotions, but it's all about it's not what happens to you, it's how you handle what happens to you. Now there is certain shit that people their pride won't let them forget it. I don't knock Jeezy I mean um Gucci for feeling the way he felt because from what I'm from what I know, they never had a conversation. It's just the diverses. I think they did have a conversation before. I don't know. I'm not sure. I was watching. I, I saw. I saw a little bit of an interview, and it was just like you know, because he was he didn't he didn't really say much. But yeah, you're matured. You took yourself out of a certain situation, and like you said, when people are on your head, I don't know what I'm walking into right now. And it's certain things like you get what I'm saying. Like we in a we in a versus battle, so it's still a kind of, even though we doing this for the culture, it's still kind of a battle. Let me ask you a question. Let me let me, let me let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. I feel like when it comes to certain people, certain certain uh, 
situations that I've been in in my life, uh, prior to music or whatever. There's certain people that I never, ever want to be in a room with. There's certain people that I, I, I can never, ever be cool, right? Is it that I'm not mature? No, it's not that you're not mature. You are mature enough to understand that I can't be in a room because I'm not ready. That's the awareness. I'm not ready for what? I'm not ready to be in a room with you. What? I'm not, like, there's certain people who did something to me, right? I can't be in a room with you because I'm not mature enough to handle that situation. That's maturity. I might, I might act out of he's my emotion. That he's mature and knowing that he can't. That he, that I'm mature. Yes, I'm mature and aware enough to not, know. Because he knows he's not be able to control. He, yes, he's not going to be able to control. So, so I'd rather I not be in a room with somebody. I don't think that do take maturity. So yes, that's maturity of, within itself. Gotta, I'm aware. I understand. So, so if I'm in a room with a person and I react, am I not mature? Um. No. No, you just yeah, you're, you're not controlled. Certain things you That's can't it. handle. It's not about yeah, certain things you can't handle. If you in a room with somebody and somebody trying to calm you down, if you acting out, like if you just acting out, that's the immaturity. But it's all about awareness. And like I said, with with that situation, that's sensitive. Because people have lost their lives and you know what I mean? I was I was on the list. So what if there's like you said there's just certain things that you can't get past but it also it takes growth and you know what i mean and i'm not mad at him i'm not mad at him i can't attack i can't judge somebody because everybody's path is different everybody learns differently everybody like you it might not be your time to understand that you need to let this go i think that gucci matured tremendously yes since he came home. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a different Gucci. Yep. Right. That night. That was big. That was a right trigger. There. That was a trigger right there. That yeah. night was a trick. It was it, it probably back. triggered him. And I'm not mad at him because at the end of the day, like, he feels he's not as he's not up here to say what happened, but he mm -hmm. feels that that man responsible for people coming to get him. Mm -hmm. So this is the first time that maybe he could address it. He felt it was a good time on that platform. Let it be known, like, nigga, I'm still here. Tribe, I'm still here. You know, he flexed a little bit. I'm not mad at him. He's great entertainment. And the reason why I'm not mad, because at the end of it, that it's still, together. It's right. still put the end result. Yeah, still, the end result. They might result. not be friends, but it's still with mutual respect. They did so icy together. And mm -hmm. they also, we, he said, we going to compound, we going to party. Mm hmm. I might have lost myself a little bit, but I got no, myself he didn't back. Let him lose no, I'm saying he, like, like I'm gonna let it be known. This is what happened. Now he told me, he said, I told you, I'm keeping it street. Right, right. This is what happened. Right. This is the songs I made because back of then. what happened. Right. And nigga, I'm doing these songs because this is a part of my catalog. Right. So it, that's that. It goes back to what I'm saying. So how how far do you evolve with, without it being detrimental? To your, to your well bit well being, right? When you look at somebody like like Nipsey Hussle who was involved, he was out there um, doing things for his community. He was out there uh, really, 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 really being um, an active activist. I call it activist, but I'm saying he was he was really active at really uh, showing what it looks like to be a role model you know, in the community, right? And still, even with all that said and done, still got killed by a nigga that wasn't involved. See, this is what I'm saying. I think that's a case of hate overpowering love. That's my point. You could, like, so, so, so what I'm saying is, when you evolve, you still have to understand that there's elements that, that's still around you that are not, right? Mm -hmm. So, how do you still deal with that? I still feel like day by day. It's like damn, you damned if you do, damn if you don't, because it's like that's life. Niggas gotta no, it's, no, no, but you can't really deal with it. Yeah. When you evolve, you have to evolve everything. Your surroundings, the way you move, the people you're around. Because if he wasn't so real and was a, another artist who'd be like, man, I'm gonna do what I'm doing for business. I'm gonna come one. I'm gonna come around once a year, and give back. I'm gonna shoot over here and talk to the. I feel like. City I feel like. I feel like. I feel like. I feel like. Too, I feel like. I feel like. I feel like. And I and I mean this. 
with all my heart and my soul. I feel like there has to be a balance. Niggas have to know that you would still, even in your evolution, step on niggas' heads. That's, 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 that's I just don't think have to. Do like, 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 I don't think have to. He slapped somebody before, so no, people no, no, understand. That's, that's regular. But that's regular. I'm saying, that. I don't think that that guy, I don't want to his name, man. I don't want to say his name, but I don't uh -huh. think dude didn't doubt or didn't have no, had no, he, I thought he knew that if it came to it, if she was ready to go, either you or me, go go all the way. I don't think he felt that if she was too evolved, wouldn't step on his head. That's why he did what he did. He ain't let it be known. And when you, and when you come from a he ain't certain, let it be known like it's on, nigga. When I see it, it was a, that was kind of like some sneak shit. He told her that whatever he told her, however it went, nigga, get out of here. Then move back and then he did what he did. He knew. That's why I felt he did that because he knew what it was. Certain people will know what you're capable of and be like, I got to do this before. That bite me. All right, you understand what I'm saying? You've been in, everybody's been in a situation and you be like, nah, I'm not even playing with this thing. I'm going to bring it right to him first because I know that he's capable of it. That's how I feel. I don't feel that he thought that Nicky was so elevated and so mature that he wouldn't step on his head. And, this, and this is this is my thing because I just posted something like this the other day. We're always posting something. Yes, yes I am. Yeah. Shout out to We Got This Project. But I posted something like this. You're not other shouting day. people out. That's me. <laughs> okay, shout them out. <laughs> it's me. That's my page. <laughs> now we live in we live on we live in a world of duality. It's light and dark. Good and bad, up and down. Like it's always. But you can't be so good. Can you? That 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 that. <laughs> Let me finish my thought, bro. Life too short to be so good that the bad just fucking attacks. You understand? Because bad feeds off of what they think is weakness. And because when you evolve, you that can be. Hold on, now you gonna get your thought. And I didn't mean to cut you off, baby girl, because you're a black woman. You need to be protected. But at the same time, right? <laughs> the thing with evolution and the thing with the streets. Sometimes I feel like. Niggas take that as a weakness. Oh, this nigga ain't like that no You're more. You're not responsible for that. You're not responsible. But, good thing but let me thing. finish. Can I finish, please? You're not, not a good thing or bad thing. Though. It can be a bad thing. It's all about Why? your perspective, the laws of attraction, and how you think your perspective is everything. If now, stupid enough to, if you stupid enough to think that that's my weakness and over and underestimate, uh, uh, overestimate yourself, and underestimate me. Nigga, you know the, the uh, the, uh, uh, what's the, uh, what? The book. <laughs> the book? 48 Law? Yeah, like you, you never put, you overestimating yourself, underestimating me because you think that because I'm carrying myself a certain way now, that all that other savage shit I just threw in the garbage? And I have nothing to do with that if I knock you out. And that's not about elevation. At, like, just because you're growing, you're human, and this is what I was saying. People are fighting. You're like a little aggressive now. Go ahead. Go ahead. Because y'all cut me off, right, and I just go. have to be a little aggressive to, in, to intervene again. Now, there's we live in a world of duality, right? There's light and there's dark. There's up. There's down. There's good. There's bad. You have to balance that out, and I think we fail to to people think automatically when you're elevating that you you're just automatically above coming back down or above your feelings getting the, the best of you or above these things with human beings. There are going to be times where you're going to get triggered. There's going to be times where people are going to keep pushing, pushing, pushing the button and you're going to push back. And of course, when you push back, it's like, oh, well, you so, you so elevated or you so, you, you're grown and you're mature. And I'm, yeah, I'm grown and I'm mature, but I'm human. You keep poking the bear, the bear's eventually gonna wake up. Now, when it comes to other people and how they interpret you, you have nothing to do with that. If I'm a nice person, I always get underestimated. I'm nice to everybody I meet. Do that mean I'm pussy? No, that don't mean I'm pussy. It could and be. I don't have to. It could, be, it could, mean it could be that, but if you try, you could try it me. Could mean that. And I, I'm, I'm good at I'm, I stand firm and I'm confident enough to be able to walk away from a situation without feeling like I'm pussy because I know I'm not. And that's the elevation. That's the growth. Not saying that I won't slap the shit out of you, but I'm choosing not to in this point. Now, have you, you, keep have, you ever, have you ever slapped the shit out of somebody? Yes, I have. Somebody said, I don't know who said this, but they said, I walk, I walk away from a situation not because I fear you, because I fear me. Yes. Right. Yes, that's me. And I'm not saying like, now, you know what I mean? I don't say that. Pussy, you 
you feeling that pussy that you, and you understand too when you get to a certain level me try slapping me. you it, it's like try me but me slapping you could fuck up everything that I've built everything that I've worked hard on and some people like they they push your buttons just to get to you there down. just to bring you down they will do it on purpose and that's why you got to be aware you know what i mean yeah, so like i always this, say so let this podcast shit fool you <laughs> like i, I always say change is inevitable but growth is choice oh shit hold on let's get this yeah, yeah, i'm just saying yeah, knowledge. it's true and you know you choose i'm choosing to walk away I don't have to walk away, but me beating your ass is proving what? It's hard to walk away, so that's why. It, it is. I it on, is. It is. My, uh, my man Let me tell you. When you just control your environment. Control, right. Control but your you don't. But even though you control your environment, you gotta understand that you can control your environment, but you don't control everybody. So even Ooh, within no, those no, situations, no, I'm saying because no, I'm, I'm a. Just, no, break that down, Tavo, because she I'm just believing. Low, break that down. Break this down, because she knows what that means. Yes, yes, the bring it, yes, the probability. What's the probability of you getting hit by a car standing in the street? It's a hot chance. It's a hot chance. You're on the sidewalk, you know it's Absolutely. Right? Yeah. So if I go places, Absolutely. I, I know places I go, I know it's a, it's a lower chance of me mm-hmm. having to step down off my, my uh, clone and, and deal with, deal with uh, certain people. Right. So that's why people are like, yo, yo, you feel you, yo, you too good? Like, I don't feel I'm too good. I'm just like you. Right. But I know what I'm going to do. Mm-hmm. And why? Chances. Put myself in a like, yeah. We go to, we go to, like, you know, yo, you got a party. It's in Brooklyn. Oh, I'm, I'm good on that, bro. Mm-hmm. I want me to come. Throw that shit in the city over, over the bridge. Well, yeah, who's going to be there? Nah, it's too mixy. Exactly. I'm not. I'm not coming. Not because I feel I'm better than y'all, because I know me. Certain things trigger me. Certain things that people do or say it might trigger you to act a certain way and then it's only gonna hurt me right ah. and that can go back to what you said like people saying what you too good or whatever it's the same thing where you proving something you have nothing to prove to anybody oh, that. i am too good i'm too good to let niggas trick me out the street right oh shit hold on <laughs> that's what it is I'm yeah trick me out the street. but that level of maturity is just all about your growth and you're not always going to be mature. And you got to understand that. People got to understand that. And if they don't, that's on them. If you underestimating my power just because I'm not out here showboating how strong I am or showboating that I'm this or showboating that I'm at, that's on you. That's your miscalculation. This is a chess game. This ain't checkers. I like checkers. Nah, I like strategy. You, you talk a lot. Strategy, I love you though. Strategy and change. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it though. Evolution though. Yeah. Evolution, Evolution is a tricky thing. Evolution is. The, it is. is. The, but that's, it's hard. It's not easy. That's the way you should be going. Because we all we all getting somewhere. We all growing up. Mm-hmm. Growing up. Experiencing new things. We we making new memories. And certain adapt. things, right, you gotta adapt to certain things that we used to care about. Some things that was important to me before is not important to me now. You understand? See, I come from a background of having enemies. Having enemies to me when I was when I was coming up, I used to say that having enemies was healthy because it kept you, it kept you alive, knowing that. There was somebody that wanted to scratch you off. Their list always kept you healthy because it always kept you thinking. It always kept you on point, so to, so to speak. You know, knowing that there was a chance that somebody was out there or people was out there that didn't um, agree with your with your breathing. You understand? Mm-hmm. You understand? So, you know, when you when you when you live like that, you know that. You gotta move in some type of way. And moving in some type of way, you be more cautious. Um, watch what you're doing. Watch what's going on. And you take less chances. You understand me? You understand me? No, I, I'm not needed. I'm no, shaking my head, yes. Yeah, but the people didn't know that. <laughs> yes, yeah. I understand. No, you. so, so evolution is cool, but it's still like, to me, it's, life is about balance. like. Everything is balanced. I don't want to be 
in a situation where it's like Lucian to me just attracts me because I went through some shit recently that I never went through. Like niggas on the internet talking crazy about me. Niggas wet niggas waited till I had on tight pants and button up shirts. <laughs> Glasses. And glasses and start talking crazy about me. Never. You go crazy, right? No, I didn't. No, I'm talking about like you could understand. Did you understand it? Like, I don't know how much people. Did you understand at first? Like, they waited to this point? And you like. Inside, like you, you know, it was interesting. I, 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 it was more in, I was more interested in, in people that I wanted to believe certain things. <laughs> right? And the thing about that, it was like. You gotta understand trickery, enemies, certain things said, done, is always ploys to try to discredit certain people, right? Now I was like, I sat back and looked, and I and I like to watch who wants to believe certain things or who wants to run with rumors because one thing we never gonna do is step out of our comfort zone to defend rumors and lies because then you you're giving more credence to some shit, and, you part of the circus. and then you then you making it more of what it is. So it's just like you just gotta let it be. But at the same time, what's interesting is it's like, oh, really? You believe that? But I'm not gonna go out my way to to disprove you because guess what? You wanted to believe that anyway. You never was riding on the side of right anyway. Yep. So that's that's the thing. But that never really, I never really lost sleep about that because that's in a, in a cyber world. It's not like in a in a in a, in a real life world. It's not. It's not real in a in an everyday, so to speak, physical world. So um, I had to I had to take that for whatever whatever it was worth because that right there is just tricking me. That's tricking me to try to trick you out of your, your element, out of your zone, trick you um, off your throne, trick you off your, off your throne. You come down because, you off your throne because you, you come down there. Right when you, when you feed into some shit, you give it more credence, you give it more life. Mm -hmm. and they can't they cut you off. They can't reach you when you up there. Right, that's a fact. So if they throw shit up there for you to come down and address, then they, don't, you, they run you down to their level. Yep. And that's when it's more vulnerable, and then that's, that's when they feel like they can reach you. That's mm -hmm. a fact. That's you a stay fact. Up and there, then once again, you wind up being a part of a circuit. You stay up there. Instead of just. That's a fact. You know what I mean? Just just that's a fact. You the king. So you, 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 you take that and these, these lessons. Right. When you watch and you learn and you, you look, you do less talking. More listening. God gave you one mouth and two ears. He wanted you to listen more than talk, right? So that's what you do. Jesus also said you have. I don't know what you just said. Hold on. What you said? Coming in here with Bible scriptures. Scriptures. Jesus said. Are you? Are you? Uh, no, I'm. Jesus? I'm not. I'm not religious, but I have read. You telling me what Jesus said? Jesus said if you have ears, pay attention. Coming in here with what Jesus said, but okay. I and that's you. something that stuck with me. If you have ears, pay attention. That's right, pay attention. I, I, you. Yeah. So, but I, I mean, you're absolutely right. You know, people try to trick you up your throne, and like I said, misery loves company. But it makes all, more sense now. It's all, it's all evolution, though. It's, mm -hmm. it's when you, when you evolve, it's when temptation. It's when the, the test comes. Is, is, is high. You, you always go, but that's the thing. You when forever you, evolving you, in life. When you went, when you when you wearing button ups, you got chairs swinging, and you know you're tatted and sweatsuits with no shirt. Yeah, you understand. The pants is fitted. You understand. And that, like I said, when R and when R&B women is on on flex on text. Oh you gosh. Understand? Jumping out of German engineer <laughs> vehicles. When you when you, and when you're smiling at all times. Oh, they times. don't like that. They don't. They don't. They don't like that. You always. They don't like when you smile. Time. They don't like when when they see you doing good. Especially people who are who are just not happy with themselves, who are miserable with themselves. Like they don't like that. They don't. That's why you gotta keep smiling. That's why you gotta keep. You know what I mean? As Mano would say, keep pushing. You know what I mean? I would say that. Yes. I say that. Keep pushing. Keep driving. Keep I chasing you, I your dreams. I give you motivation, man. I know. I give my niggas motivation. That's what they Absolutely. need. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Money. I tell them the real. I understand. Listen, I tell them what is what's 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 needed. What's right. You understand? I saw a meme we the other day that said motivated. it's crazy. People even don't like you when you're minding your business. Say it again. It's something like people don't. It's crazy how people still don't like you when you're minding your business. But I think that's what it is. They be wanting you to be a part of shit. They be wanting to stir shit up. They don't like when you're minding your business. I ain't seen nothing. Get on Jesus. That's yes, they did. Oh. Jesus loves you. God bless. <laughs>
you love you, man. Oh, man. He just loves you, man. You, 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 you're doing good out here, man. I'm proud of you, man. You know? We see you out here. Ready to say something? You were ready to say something. You were so ready to say something. So we about to, we about to be Thanksgiving. Next, back to Thanksgiving, nigga? I'm saying next is Christmas. I'm going to be heading to New Year. New Year's tomorrow. That's how I look at it. I'm out the game, man. Oh, now oh, yes. You, <laughs> you want me to start? I'm tired, I'm tired of getting catfish. I'm about the game. How you got catfish? I keep getting catfish. I'm tired, man. How? Just keep getting catfish. So you out the game. So what does that mean? I'm chilling. What does chilling mean? I'm chilling. I'm focusing on what needs to be. And what what needs to be? Business. So you focus on business. You're not focused on women anymore. That's what you're saying. I was never focused on that. I'm trying to understand what out the I'm game. I'm just saying. Is. I'm just tired of being. Why, why are you so like, aggressive? The thing about these, these Instagrams. You fall for it. You ever notice? Let me meet a girl. No, let me, let me, let me, let me change that. You ever, you ever seen a girl on Instagram and you finally get a chance to get around her? You're like, damn, she really don't look the same. She really is not the same. That's my issue. I'm fucking the whole fat bitch because of that. You said that on, on. No, I, in TV I, land? No, I, no I'm saying I did want? that. I have done that before, is what I'm saying. I've done, I was, I was, I was, so hey, hey, girl. Listen, listen, listen to the story, though. Listen to what I'm saying. I like this girl. See, you know, once he figured out that she wasn't how she looked on Instagram. He still kept going. Mm -hmm. Listen to the story. I, I know. He said, I fuck fucking. No, fuck. I oh, fuck and fuck. I mean, he did it anyway. He but seen her. Make the point another time. <laughs> but right because because in the pictures it was like she hear that fucking voluptuous it was, it was different I guess it was like what's that, that app Facetune mm -hmm. you don't know you don't use that okay because you are black queen as you know natural one time dude <laughs> all natural oh, oh, oh natural yeah this is happening I'm tired of it though so you ever told anybody no. <laughs> Have you ever told a woman no? All the time. Yeah, my man respectfully, I told What's him wrong with you, man. Because like, you, because he just out. said, you just said, like I'm looking at old fat bitch, or I, didn't mean, I was. I didn't like mean, a whole other turn, though. You're not Why? Because she showed up. Yeah, she here. So? You know what? You know, hey, this is probably bombing at night. Nobody, nobody gonna go home. Nobody wanna watch Sports Center. That's what you're not gonna do. You're not going upstairs, turn on Sports Center. COVID, you got to make game plan, don't make that many highlights. Netflix? Ain't doing that. Not even Netflix? No, we got Netflix, we got something right here. We're going to do it for that one time, huh? and it's just tomorrow when we wake up. We're not going to send it home. If you pay for the Uber, we're not going to send it back and watch Netflix. Okay. That's just not going to happen. Okay. Things happen, man. So ladies, don't feel special. The nigga do it. I mean, he's doing it. It's just because he don't want to watch Netflix or sports on Let me know that now. Some of y'all got what's, the dick. What's, what's the, the default? <laughs> what's, what's, some of y'all got the dick. What's the default? Hold on, no pause. Yeah, no pause. Yeah, no pause. No pause. No pause. No pause. No pause. No pause. No pause, man. So, you yeah, out the game. Chilling. Yeah, I'm chilling. I, I know I said this before, but I'm, I'm chilling. Let's, I, heard, I heard it so many you know, times. That's why I'm, I'm like repeating listen, it so you can hear yourself. Because I, I, I want everybody to hear this. Listen. I want everybody to hear this. He's listen. saying that he's out the game. Out the game. My son is turning 18. I'm out the game. Let's chase him more track. Then I'm out the so game. Stop hitting my DMs. Let's ask me to pass the message to him. Let's chase him more track. Then more track. Then I'm out the game. That's it. Jermaine is out the game. That's it. It's over. So, Ladies, if if you can, if if you know this is true, or if you know this is not true, please. So nobody know, took you out of the game. Know. You just you took it out for right now. Yeah, I'm bowing out. I'm, I'm sitting on the bench right now because it's just it's just I'm just, just tired. You got you got to. Uh, what you tired of? <laughs> Catherine? I'm dog tired. Dog tired, tired boss. I'm dog tired, boss. I'm tired. Straight up, I'm tired. It's it's it's, he not, it's frivolous. He's not, he not gonna give up the game. Like discipline. You think you got, got enough discipline? He got this fantasy in his head about getting out the light. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he got this fantasy. <laughs> he got this fantasy. Oh, Let's see if it's real. No, it's it's part of evolution, right? We're talking about evolution and maturity, right? This is what we're talking about. So you so you you waiting for that special someone? I'm not saying. <laughs> I don't know if... Come on, Michael. 
Yeah. <laughs> no, you know I'm gonna go there. Yeah, because this is not a love no, show. Yeah. Love, like you go. You, you the one who said I'm out the game. You brought That's, it up. But then you going a little too deep. You said you chilling, so you Waiting looking for that for, special one. You looking for um, somebody? And boy, not looking. I'm not looking. That, that, I don't think that works. I didn't mean to say looking. I meant like, are you are you waiting all for somebody I'm, to come I'm, in to attract? Listen, all I'm saying is that I'm I'm chilling. That's it. That's chasing or attracting, and that's with everything. You understand? Like that's that's certain shit you don't gotta force it. Things you don't gotta force. You don't gotta force. You don't force huh? flow. In the midst of trapping, if you bump into something, then it's whatever. Yeah, everything organically, everything, whatever's meant to be will be. You don't gotta you don't gotta force nothing. Yeah. Come on, miss you. Oh man, she just <laughs> You know I always gotta quote for oh, everything. Oh, man. Sheesh. Hey. Like I said, whatever's meant to be, will be. So if it's meant, you're gonna have it. I ain't gotta chase nothing. I don't gotta force it. And I ain't gotta be looking. I'm chilling. That's it. That's it. Sound like you said the same type of thing. What you you? Yeah, but yeah she... I said what I was meant for me. Oh, God. Oh, Missy. No. Okay, so you understand? Yes. Well, why you asking me fucking questions? Because he's different. He ain't looking, but he he be looking. Anyway. I ain't looking. I be chilling. It's Any, a difference. Anyway. Anyway, <laughs> anyway I, I, I don't even want to stay on that right now because we're going somewhere else, man. But I'm going to tell you what, though. I'm looking forward to this Mike Tyson and Roy Jones fight. Hold on. Oh, Mike Tyson. Uncle Mike. Mike Tyson and Roy Jones. He's not your uncle. Yes, he is. Talking about that shit in high fight, Mike Tyson. Yeah, you did say that, and I wanted to I say wanted to that. I want to retract that statement. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, the Mike Tyson I was talking about with the stomach and nah, the weed, yeah. chilling Mike Tyson. This Mike Tyson, he's always the same Mike Tyson, though, bro. Nah, bro. He will fuck you around. No, he's in shape. He will fuck. He would have fucked you up the last time. He would have fucked. No, he would have fucked. Mike Tyson. I would have beat the shit out of him. So you telling me? <laughs> This, hold on. I'm telling you, I'm not a bitch to no man. Hold on, hold on, hold on, this earth hold on. Mike Tyson. Gonna beat the shit out of me. That's what I'm going to be. It's no man that breathes the same air that I breathe that's walking that's cool. this green earth. That's cool. That I'm admitting that's, that's cool. Beat the shit out of me. Having confidence is okay. Cool Having confidence is okay. But what I'm telling Boy, you is this. Well, I mean, cool no problem. Having you? confidence is cool. I can beat you. Oh, whatever. But that's a different story. <laughs> Listen. Having confidence is cool. But the truth is this. Mike Tyson. I am Mike Tyson. I am Mike. Too. I am Mike. Not the not the stomach part. <laughs> even even, <laughs> even even smoking weed, stomach, stomach chilling, all that. That's two different mics. Dancing, cooling. That's two different mics. He would fuck you up. That's two you, different mics. You my brother. Mike Tyson will beat you under the ground. That's two different mics, bro. Mike Tyson will beat you under the ground. Mike Tyson will beat you under the ground. He a little different. He for we talk. Mike Tyson. Man, come on, Mike Tyson will beat you under the ground, bro. I'm Either one. I mean, like, like I'm Either one. I'm not, I'm not talking you. about like intelligent. Ones. Listen, I'm talking about strip one. We need to rectify this, bro. Either one. I'm not admitting that's going to whip my ass. That's just the best way. But you don't gotta admit nothing. Think think about about it. It. You, you don't. Have, you ain't gotta no. admit it for it to be reality. We don't know. Right. Right, niggas go in the ring with niggas all the time and lose and get the shit beat out it's of them. It's because he got a belly, and that doesn't mean yeah. his, his punches are, they they don't have the same effect. Brave enough to get in there. That's Hold what on. matters. Let's get this. Confidence. Okay. You have to get his, you have to, you have to show me. Get his brain knocked loose. Okay. Get his brain knocked loose. Brain knock loose. But I got in there. It's okay. Would you fight Mike? Bad niggas yeah. got in there. Right. Mitch, what is this? Mitch Green and them niggas got in there. I got in there. Man, would what? you fight Mike? What? So what? Would you fight him? Fight him what? Like, let's just say a situation. Lovely match. You versus Mike Tyson. Are you taking the match? Yeah, but is it money? <laughs> <laughs> he gonna look like Martin. That determines, that's a good point. That determines everything. That's a good he point. gonna look like Martin. I don't wanna fight no more. <laughs> she know I don't wanna that fight no more. That determines everything. Is it is it money? If is, it was money. If that's what I'm hoping to. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If it's money. Me fighting Mike Tyson? Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> he's got to I'm in there. Ooh. I'm fighting Mike. For cool, for cool M. I'm definitely fighting Mike for cool M. You gonna run around the ring? Well, no, uh, I'm fighting them. After Texas, <laughs> I'm fighting. Them. After Texas, <laughs> I'm taking my fifteen percent, so that's gonna leave you with um. <laughs> I'm fighting Mike. Ooh. 
How many rounds, though? Jeez. <laughs> three rounds. He ain't gonna need them. I'm definitely going three rounds. He ain't gonna need them. He ain't gonna need them. He's gonna three. He's not knocking me out, though. We're gonna give you a no, 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 no. extra I'm, 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 one. I'm gonna be dancing. AKA. And they gonna be getting mad show to action. Running. Whoa. Whoa. I'm gonna be dancing. I'm gonna be dancing in there. You gonna have them, you them sad legs. Three, 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 three minute rounds, bro. You ain't making three it minutes. Three minutes. He's not making it three minutes. Three minutes is a long time. We ain't making it three rounds. That's a whole minutes. song. First of all, first of all, first of all, first of all, I'm gonna have the time to prepare. Nigga, how you can have how much? Ain't no prepare. He's stressed to prepare. <laughs> he gonna put that mean I need to shut the He gonna put that fade. You talking about what? He gonna put that fade in the grave. <laughs> 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 we talking about Mike Tyson. I'm fighting, I, listen, I'm fighting Mike now, Tyson. No, this now. Mike Tyson's my favorite fighter. That's a he fact. is a Brooklyn legend. Facts. But I'm not admitting to no man whooping my ass. Well, I'm admitting to it. He whipping your ass. <laughs> <laughs> no man walking. Yeah, I'm admitting to it. He gonna whip your ass. That's it. Right. I'm fighting Mike. Three rounds, million dollars. I'm in there. <laughs> What if, what if he sees this? Predict, and he goes to one round. So what? You predict him to go it's going. Round? It's going. It's going all the way. Decision. It's going to a decision. <laughs> what if Mike see this and be like a million dollars? Yeah. No, I'm, I'm just saying. What if he put up there? He be like a million dollars. Okay, like, I'm doing it. Give me two hundred thousand. Like I'm going in. I'm going doing it. What is she talking about? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm fighting Mike for a mil. I'm doing it. I'm doing I'll put it. you in that motherfucker ring. He give me a meal. A meal, we go. I'm that. doing it. He gonna when be, it lose, you get a meal. He gonna be looking like Martin after. Uh, he's a hater. Oh, I'm <laughs> doing it. George, he got his ass whipped for less. So that meal gonna be a <laughs> boy. Get to listen to him, George. <laughs> I'm going in there. I'm training. I, how many? It don't, it, listen, bro. it don't matter. I'm training for, what? for the fight. You need, the only training you need to do, they need to prepare you how to fall, how to fall properly. <laughs> Fast. You know your land incorrectly. That's what you need to train. You gotta That's get your legs you right. Yeah. Get your legs right for Probably the fall. <laughs> when I go, legs. when I go to 